But the truth of the matter is that we all grieve as a community. We grieve together because of things that happen around us because the majority of us are fairly empathic. We actually care about what happens to the people around us. We have compassion. And if we watch something on TV, and this is, this is proven, it's actually a proven thing. If you watch something on TV and you're watching somebody say, um, do downhill skiing, right? And you're watching it from a first person perspective. It, there's no difference in your brain that tells it that you're not doing it yourself. So, so it's easy for us to be traumatized in modern society because we play games that are traumatizing. We watch TV that is traumatizing. We experience trauma from the world at large. And all of this leaves a need for us to release this grief. So, you know, if you have grief that you want to release and you want to give to the ancestors and you want to be able to go about your life and you have a desperate need, whether it's, you know, maybe your cousin or your neighbor got raped, or maybe it's that you experienced something bad or negative yourself. Maybe, maybe, you know, somebody who died, 